and get the truth from the bam yes it's just a waste of time the truth ain't for everybody now we go get into this so-called rt this local news clip that they got right here with the so-called victoria secrets and they basically tell you that victoria secret want to support so-called body shaming and all of that <laughs> that's a damn joke you understand the reason why they use these wooden foot man is because of low fat count you understand a woman carry carry more fat count than a man a man have more muscle mass and all you can see on these sodomites is muscle mass trimmed down with all muscle mass you understand those are what victoria secret want to model their clothes man in drags I'm on. Here's what we know about mm -hmm. obesity in America. Obesity. I had a feeling you might go there. Mm -hmm. Yes, they're <laughs> laughing at the dumb people. You'll never get it. There's a reason why this Rick Sanchez right here with the giggling face on. They're all laughing at the masses. He used to work for CNN, but a lot of people feel like RT News is a real news station. You're dumb as a box of rocks. It's the same people control the RT, control the CNN, ABC and all. 100 percent all news company all the same people you understand fooling the dumb masses with their fake news it's never been worse mm -hmm. obesity mm -hmm. in america think mm -hmm. about it in fact here let me give you some numbers mm -hmm. you can look these up yourself quick mm -hmm. google search right 43 yes, percent of middle-aged quick google search as you could see the hand sign that's the triple six right there for the mark of the beast and you're never gonna get it you understand all those shit that you search that's what they want you to find that's why google they post it up as one of the so-called so -called verif verification line, verification set. <laughs> you can go there and verify, verify anything you want. And basically, most of the time, people use it for the so-called fact check. You're dumb as a box of rocks. It's the same people that giving you the lies, so-called giving you truth. Americans now classify as obese. Mm -hmm. 43 percent. Mm -hmm. For your number seven. Mm-hmm. Doctors say it's affecting mm -hmm. everything from our health mm -hmm. to our insurance actuary tables mm -hmm. to our wow. longevity. In fact, here's another one for you. Mm -hmm. Write this one down. Mm -hmm. For the first time ever, the average American lifespan here mm -hmm. in the United mm -hmm. States, mm -hmm. down. We're dying mm -hmm. sooner. You hear that, people? Right? You hear that? And of course, they're mocking you. I already told you, people. Why you think they have this mockery right here? Call it nose. It's a mockery for the people. You understand? I told you. Why your lifespan is shortened. Why? The government food that you eat, the vaccine that they plug in you, and all the water that you drink that they give you is just to kill you quicker. I already told you that's going to kill the whole wide world of knowledge because people die faster. Nobody there to pass it on. Okay? And much of that is because of obesity, say mm -hmm. researchers. Yes, obesity, But because they're, but they're never going to tell you to stop eating those food. They're never going to tell you to stop taking that vaccine, stop giving it to your kids. They're never going to tell you that. So many more obese mm -hmm. people. Mm -hmm. Here's the irony. Mm -hmm. It has become a movement of mm -hmm. sorts to defend. Mm -hmm. And so this is on screen right here. Saddam and Gomorrah this best. And like I tell you, they are wooden foot man. Why they're showing off their ass right here. And Rick Sanchez, you know 100% what it is. It's just sodomism they bring on TV. Every forms time. of obesity. Mm -hmm. Despite what doctors are saying. Mm -hmm. Along comes the Victoria's Secret Fashion Show, mm -hmm. broadcast every yes. year mm -hmm. on ABC Network Television, mm -hmm. except mm -hmm. this year. Mm -hmm. And let me tell you why. Yeah. Because protesters are now arguing that Victoria's Secret wow. as a company... protesters, people, you believe that they care about protesters? Those are the same government people that protesting just how to divide the people. You have an opposition and you have the so-called main people. You understand? So now Victoria's Secret going to take it from the so-called protesters and cancel the show? I don't think so. And as a show mm -hmm. is not inclusive enough. Mm -hmm. Yes. Because mm -hmm. it promotes unattainable mm -hmm. body what image standards. Mm -hmm. In other words, standard. they want mm -hmm. bigger models on the show. Wow, they and want bigger models on the show. Okay. In general, mm -hmm. in their magazines. Mm -hmm. Victoria's Secret tried to argue, look, mm -hmm. the show promotes models. Mm -hmm. We're not trying to promote the average woman. Mm -hmm. These are models. Mm -hmm. Protesters wouldn't have it. Mm -hmm. And the last Victoria's Secret official said, enough is enough, mm -hmm. and they've canceled the show. What you don't understand, people, this that they put on right here is actually bigger than the show. It's bigger than the actual Victoria's Secret model show right here, the news. That's how they do it, people. This is how they put a spotlight on these men in a drag walking around with the wings. 
for the fallen angel. It's just a buffy message. I buy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Gone. Adios. Mm -hmm. Let's start there. Mm -hmm. Here is RT correspondent Rachel Blavins. Yes, here we go. Life Rachel expectancy Blavins. in the United mm -hmm. States is decreasing. And take a look at this Rachel Blavins right here, people, because I do believe that you don't even look like a real person. It sounds like a bat and everything. And look how wide the shoulder is. And I told you, got a few Adam's apple in the neck. And these weird looking foot look like Taylor Swift. Of course, it's a damn man. An alarming rate, especially for young people, mm -hmm. with the main causes including mm -hmm. drug overdoses, oh, suicide, and obesity. Mm -hmm. This, according to a new study, mm -hmm. which found that the recent mm -hmm. decrease... Who fucking doing those studies? That's what we want to know. All these studies coming out later on, you say, oh, the study was wrong. Why did you take it in the first place? Who the fuck making these studies? It's nothing but fake shit, people. Time for you to wake up. They're not real. They're full of shit. All studies is fake shit programming for the dumb people. The U.S. life expectancy mm -hmm. culminated a period of increasing mm -hmm. cause-specific mortality among mm -hmm. adults aged 25 mm -hmm. to 64 years. Mm -hmm. That began in the 1990s, mm -hmm. ultimately producing an increase in all-cause mortality that began in 2010. Mm -hmm. While other wealthy countries have seen an increase in life expectancy... Look at this shit right here, people. Is this a real person standing right there? First of all, these legs don't look right, but I said, people, why is it moving like a damn bat? You don't look real to me, people, and it never do sound real. That RT news have of some real suspicious characters doing the damn news. See, the study noted that the U.S. has become an alarming exception, mm -hmm. and the segment of Americans who are being hit mm -hmm. the hardest this are is those... the same way they do those so-called live news. You see all the background behind it? That's how they do it, people. Somebody so-called gets shot at a store, they put the store right there, and the person standing in front of it acting like it's in the road doing the nose. Wake up, people. ...who should be in the prime of their mm -hmm. lives. Yet the amount of money Americans mm -hmm. spend on health care is twice what it was mm -hmm. in the 1980s mm -hmm. and All significantly by design, more... people, because the health care costs more than the so-called life insurance. I already told you that. They give you so-called health insurance for a whole bunch of money. And, of course, they give you the so-called Obamacare that go up, down, up, down. So you know already... The insurance company is still robbing the masses, no matter what you are under. You understand me? So, of course, they're never going to protect your health care, but they can hurry up and sell you a life insurance because they know you're going to dead fast. No doubt about than it. other developed countries. Mm -hmm. One of the biggest factors influencing low life expectancy in the U.S. is obesity. Mm -hmm. According to the CDC, an estimated 71.6% mm -hmm. of adults aged 20 and over are overweight in the U.S. Mm -hmm. But instead of backlash focused on the obesity epidemic mm -hmm. or widespread campaigns aiming to increase life expectancy, mm -hmm. we have seen increased criticism directed at brands that are not deemed inclusive by today's standards. Mm -hmm. Women's clothing brand Victoria's Secret... Mm -hmm. And look at the people that they represent people look at who Sism, directed them. at brands that are not mm -hmm. deemed inclusive mm -hmm. by today's standards mm -hmm. women's clothing brand look at this right here people you think that's a woman look at the shoulders on this one right here with no hips it's not a woman Victoria's secret mm -hmm. has been at the forefront of mm -hmm. that frustration go, with people if buffy met taking their oath right here with their hand on the chest it is a man Criticism drive. targeted at there the company for only feature Buffy clothing They're brand Victoria's Secret has been mm -hmm. at the forefront of that mm -hmm. frustration with criticism targeted... They're not real female, just some paint-up man with the bando on, modeling the so-called lingerie from the Victoria's Secret. A lot of people never pay attention. Why the fuck is called secret? What's going on? They all man in drags. Post up as woman at the Bam. company for only featuring models mm. that are at least 5'9 and mm. size zero. 5'9 yes, the... <laughs> and size zero. Victoria's mm -hmm. Secret did announce a partnership mm -hmm. that featured its first plus size model mm -hmm. last month. And yes, it... plus size <laughs> is the same man in a fat suit. That's what you need to know. You see how they bend up? Why they have to bend up like this, people? This is how they teach them so they can look like females, but they're not. Pay attention. Hired its first transgender mm -hmm. model. Or Hired that first transgender model. They fold the masses. Remember, the heat is on them. I already bust them out years ago and tell the masses that there's only drag queens in there. So now and then, they say, oh, we released the first drag as a known drag. The same thing they do in the so-called beauty pageants. After we call them out, the Miss Americas and all of those, we call them out the Miss Universe. That is all drag. So you know what they do? They say they're entering a first time for the first time a drag queen. The same thing they do with the Victoria's Secret. The same fucking people 
they tell you it's a drag. Same one they tell you it's not. Dumb on. Bigger this year, oh, many oh, believe. All of them is drags. That's why they neck tie up. That's why they wear wings. The changes are too little, too mm -hmm. late. The brand's mm -hmm. annual televised fashion you show go. received the mm -hmm. worst ratings in its mm -hmm. history. Show mm -hmm. received the Watch this one right here, people. Take a look at this one neck. There, the other map right there. Pay attention. First ratings in its mm -hmm. history last year. Mm -hmm. And as a result, Victoria's Secret has announced that mm -hmm. it will not be televising mm -hmm. a 2019 version of the show. Mm -hmm. In a statement, CEO Les Wexner said, quote, mm -hmm. fashion is a business of change. Mm -hmm. We must evolve. You see the V right there for your number six with the damn serpent wrapping to it? Wow, satanic code. Change to grow, and mm -hmm. with that in mind, we have decided to rethink the traditional Victoria's mm -hmm. Secret fashion show. Mm -hmm. Going forward, we don't believe network television is the mm -hmm. right fit. Mm -hmm. But the latest studies yes, are raising. Don't worry, anywhere they go, the people gonna follow. Say, for instance, they're gonna put it on a so called YouTube or one site. Everybody gonna flock it. That's just how it is, people. Questions mm -hmm. once again about whether Americans have their priorities straight and mm -hmm. how today's problems will impact the next generation. Mm -hmm. In Washington, Rachel mm -hmm. Blevins, RT. Yes, All Sorry, right, and look Blevins. who's in the house. Mm -hmm. yes, the good doctor. You. The doctor mm -hmm. is in the house. Why are you think it laughing when it said it's a doctor? Because <laughs> it is a joke. It's not a doctor, people. It's just a faker. When it's on TV, of course, it's a damn... Calling doctor. Dr. Dombrowski. Thank you. Um, mm -hmm. This is a fascinating story. Mm -hmm. Think about what I just mm -hmm. said a little while mm -hmm. ago. The mm -hmm. propensity of overweight people in America now mm -hmm. is so large mm -hmm. that they, in and of themselves, are mm -hmm. becoming a movement. And mm -hmm. they defend that movement by saying, how dare you criticize mm -hmm. our obesity. That puts you as a doctor in a really funky, Not weird place. I mean, we never want to criticize people for who they are or mm -hmm. what they are. But I'm more mm -hmm. concerned about their health. And mm -hmm. sometimes... You believe that this guy right here care about your health or concern about your health? You're in a world of hurt, people. These are the government puppets. They use to trick the masses. They care nothing about the people. Not fat shaming anybody, but mm -hmm. sometimes when we mention that, mm -hmm. it might make them feel a little uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. And you know and what? We're all your days are the same people puff you up with that food. Every fucking program you watch on TV, here comes the McDonald's commercial, the Burger Kings, the Wendy's, the Popeyes. All of them show up. What do you think, people? It's by design, and the people never get it. It's a government operation. All of those fast food places. All of those lab meat that they're selling the vegans is by design. Not doing that to mm -hmm. shame you or say you're a naughty person or you're mm -hmm. a bad person. Mm -hmm. We're shame. We are letting you know. Mm -hmm. you're, we are letting you know mm -hmm. you're on an unhealthy way. Mm -hmm. Just like these great models. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, this is canceled. I was mm -hmm. looking forward to this, mm -hmm. but many of these <laughs> models had the exact mm -hmm. opposite problem in their health. Mm -hmm. They were too thin. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So wow. you just can't. Say there was too thin. <laughs> I told you people, check back the tradition and see who they use to model. <laughs> Victoria's Secret or any one of them is just drag man, bony man. It's all fat mm -hmm. or all really uber thin, mm -hmm. but there's got to be thin. what is healthy, what is a healthy diet, mm -hmm. what is a healthy outlook for, you know, someone's longevity. I don't mm -hmm. want to stay too long on the political side of this, no. but I do see it as mm -hmm. maybe guys like you and I. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you fancy yourself as a great athlete, so do I. Wow. <laughs> and I'd love to think that the NFL <laughs> should put me on even though I'm 60 years old mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. I of think I can play. you 60 coding for the masses. Football well, right. but it's not mm -hmm. about that. No. Those mm -hmm. guys are, are unbelievable mm -hmm. athletes. Right. These models mm -hmm. are unbelievable models because okay, why why they are um, um, uh, unbelievable models why because they dress them up in some gowns and send them out there to act like females i don't think so so, so arguing i should mm -hmm. be on there even though i'm heavy mm -hmm. just seems mm -hmm. well and, and, and again you know this is whole and we do you want every people to wear your victoria secrets yes of course they will put every people in there if they want of course because they want to entice everybody that's why no one then they will slap somebody different on the magazine for a while and say, yeah, there you go. We show you that we promote fat girls too, a big plus size woman. Of course, they're just mocking the damn people. 100% It's the same drag in a fat suit. I had this problem with the culture for a very, very long time in yeah. terms of who's on magazine covers and things like mm -hmm. that. So we have more plus size women or mm -hmm. men who may not be as attractive. And I get that. Mm -hmm. You know, and I oh, got it. These are all men. <laughs> These are all drags. No matter what you say, no matter what route you're trying to take it, that's a drag. That is a part of our population. Right. But these mm -hmm. are, you know, for like it or not, these are models. Mm -hmm. And this is what yes. men and women kind of aspire to, mm -hmm. whether that's wow. healthy or unhealthy. Mm -hmm. Bottom line is, mm -hmm. what is a healthy diet? What is a healthy weight? Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. And now, again, these women are unbelievable. I got it. I see this background here. Unbelievable fake. That's what it is, people. And they're here to brainwash you all the way in. And a lot of grown folks take it and run. I just call them dumb. I'm gone.